Hey everyone, you made it. This is part three of our three part video series on setting up that Discord server. I'm your host Andy from Primacy Gaming. And in today's video, we're gonna cover a couple key topics on setting up the AFK channel, some welcome message topics, the moderation stuff on filter settings on your server, which you really need to know. And of course, changing your avatar and some other little minor tweaks to get your server all dialed in. Well, with that in mind, let's get into this video. And as always, you know how to follow us. Check out, we're posting five days a week now, if you can see this on your screen. And let's start this up. Thanks again. Hey guys, thanks for sticking with us. And this is where I'm covering how to change your avatar, the moderation settings, your AFK channel and some welcome stuff uh, for your greetings for your pages. What you're gonna wanna do is right click on your server, go to server settings, and we're gonna go to overview right now. And when we go to overview, you can change your icon here for your server overview icon, upload an image, change that. And as we scroll down to here, we're gonna see, uh, we're gonna see AF, uh, we're gonna see, it normally say is no AFK channel. I set up an AFK channel, I just added an AFK channel. And if you add an AFK channel, if you kind of see it there, it's, it's down here, here. Um, you can click on the AFK channel and then you can tell them, you know, after five minutes of being AFK, it automatically dumps them into this channel. You set up this channel with no speak, you know, they can't do anything. You should just have it set up where they go into that channel, they can connect to the channel, but that's it. They can't, they can't speak in the channel. It's basically a channel for a no man's land channel where they gotta go back if they wanna talk. You don't wanna dump them into an AFK channel and then that becomes like a hangout channel. So just so you guys know that, just set it up in the permissions so that they cannot speak in the channel and they really can't do anything else. Just put connect and not anything else. So with that, we're gonna go to system message channel. If you wanna set up them, you know, to have your welcome message uh, sent when someone comes on the server and well, the welcome page, um, you can set that up so that, that that comes up to your new, uh, you know, people coming on, that's fine. You, you can set it up, you don't have to set it up, it's up to you. And then lastly here, make sure this is not checked to all messages, make sure it's only at mentions because you will get a zillion messages otherwise and that will just be a nightmare. It's just too many notifications. So once you've done that, save those changes and then we'll move on to moderation. Moderation uh, is your verification levels first. You can set this as low or as high as you want. I mean, medium's a good setting. They have to be registered on Discord for longer than five minutes. Uh, explicit content filter. I always set ours at scan messages sent by all members because no matter what members you have or what roles, you know, if they send something, let's say some child porn or some weird pick, uh, that will delete it if it picks it up. It's pretty good at picking up anything that shouldn't be on your server. It's not going to maybe get everything, but it's pretty good. So you want to rely on your admins and mods to make sure your server stays clean so you don't run into any problems with anyone else. You don't have to scan if you don't want to, but you're you're running the risk to do that. I, I wouldn't do it, but it's all up to you. So uh, server two factor authentication, if you wanna do that, uh, you can, you don't have to. If you, if you wanna enable that, it's fine for, for authenticating. Other than that, your audit logs, audit logs, pretty straightforward. Uh, roles, we already went over the roles. Integrations, emojis. You can upload external emojis if you wanna upload them here. You can they can use them on on your site. You can use them. That's just fine. Uh, it's not you know for messages between members. You got then you can have a list of a bunch of emojis that everyone uploaded. That's kind of cool. But um, you can do that. And other than that, that is almost it. Other than your avatar. So if you want to change your avatar for your person, which I get asked here and there, just go down to user settings. Just click on it and just edit your um, avatar, just real straightforward, just edit it. That should be about it for this whole video. So hope you guys liked it. Please like, subscribe, and share. And if you wanna see any other videos like this, please let us know. We're always trying to get the better content out there, put a lot of time into this one. I probably did 100 takes, but I hope to see you guys soon and check out our Discord link at the bottom in the descriptions. You can visit us on Twitter and always let us know what you like to see content wise. 
because we're up for anything on Primacy Gaming. So as always, have a great day and Primacy Gaming out.